election results of President... Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Hmm. So that's your briefing, that's all you're gonna... glasses again. That's all you're gonna get from these people. But you can mess with them. Get away from there, Freeman. I'm expecting an important message. Right. I believe there's also an alarm that you can mess around with. Come on, wait, what are you that doing? That shut down procedure chart. Come on, Gordon. You trying to get me into trouble? <laughs> I always do that because it's. Uh, I find that to be funny. Yeah, we're supposed to be getting into a suit, no smoking area. This is like a uh, cafeteria. Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Hello. My God, what are you doing? What? Was that a bacon? Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Clock, clock, clock. I'm trying to not talk about the NPCs. Hello. Hello. This is a toilet. <coughs> Open up! Alright, just uh, let's get to the... suit. Looks like two other suits are taken. As I expected. System for use in hazardous environment conditions. I don't know why this music comes on every time I put on the suit. <laughs> Go right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Oh come on! It was a, it ah, was a traffic. Good to see you. It wasn't my fault. All right, I do believe if I like go corner. Doctor Victor, report to Super Cool Laser Laboratory, please. Did you say Super Cool Laser Laboratory? I didn't hear it. We're taking the elevator. It's gonna take some time. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> You really have to admire the graphics. It's uh... Brings back memories, but I never played this game before. I am a bit... never mind. There's nothing down there. Hello there. Hello. Hello? If I'm a scientist, why do I have to work like this? Greetings! Can you let me? Th oh, never mind. It's a level three door. You don't need permission to get in. Greetings. Greetings. Ah, Gordon. Here you are. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105 percent. Bit of a gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. What's gonna happen to me? This is the chest test chamber. Ah, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, uh, coming through. It's about to go critical. What the hell is going on with our equipment? It wasn't meant to do this in the first place. 
So behind this cardboard looking machinery there's a... There's more cardboard looking machinery. That's interesting. Look how many... Caution? We're scientists, nothing wrong can happen. Test lab. Hello, Dr. Freeman. I'm Freeman, sorry. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedures today, Gordon. Yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Highly trained professional. I was trying to read their name cards. It's of, it's of course uh, obviously low quality textures, so I can't read it. Couldn't make out. Testing. 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 Damn. Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. If you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. 80%? I don't know what science stuff they're saying. All I could understand the anti-mass spectrometer. Huh, probably should have paid attention in classes, I suppose. Pretty sure they don't teach this. <laughs> At least not in my level. We'll take it from here. Power to stage one emitters in three, two, one. Know your name? Uh, it's probably not a problem. Probably, but I'm showing a small discrepancy. In, well, no, it's well within acceptable bounds. Sustaining signals. I've just been informed that the sample is ready, Gordon. It should be coming up to you any moment. Look to the delivery system for your specimen. Ah, yes, yes, yes. I think you can just... Come here! Gordon! Get away from the beat! Shut it down! No! Uh. It's not... Ah. It's not... It's not shut it down! It's, it's not... This is bad! This is very very bad! What the hell? I didn't notice there were aliens! First time! Oh that's cool! Oh please! Am I dead? I mean, I still have 100 health. Oh, oh my god! I'm back! Holy... Bull squid! Vortigons? Hello! Morning! 